Hey everybody, Brian here from Witch Doctor. Uh, did a test today of shoulder bump. Um, there are various tools you can use to measure shoulder bump, but I want to show you some of the tools that I use. Um, one is a Wilson case gauge and a Wilson case gauge micrometer. Just goes right on top of the case gauge there and uh, gives you a really easy and quick reading of your shoulder bump. So for example, a fired piece of brass, just throw it in there, put the case gauge over it, find your zero, and then turn it down. Looks here a fired case is about three thousandths, uh, three thousandths above zero. Okay, so that gives you that reading. Um, here I did a very light shoulder bump, about a half a thousandths to a thousandths. And actually, you can do this measurement with the bullet in it, which is the beauty of this kind of system. Uh, not only is it quick, but you can also, if you accidentally loaded your rounds before you checked your shoulder bump, you can actually put them in loaded. Here we have about two thousandths. So for this test, what we did is we uh, bumped the shoulder uh, about a thousandths, and then we bumped the shoulder two thousandths, and then we bump the shoulder three thousandths. Um, as you can see here, bumping the shoulder barely just a thousandths, but a half a thousandths to a thousandths, uh, the groups were pretty big, 0.534 and 0.425. Um, this side here, these groups were shot in wind. There was lots of wind today at the range, um, shot these three groups in the wind, and then all of a sudden the conditions died down, and I shot these three groups in pretty much no wind. But you can see here how just barely bumping it at a half a thousandths to a thousandths, the groups were pretty wide and large. Um, you can tell too when you're cranking down the bolt, it's a little bit difficult to crank the bolt down. It's definitely a heavy bolt close. Um, they would call this a, a hard crushed fit. Um, bumping two thousandths is a very light crushed fit. You can, you know, it's not really hard to close the bolt. Um, and you can see here both groups were really good in the ones. Uh, 0.193 in the wind, 0 0.180 no wind. And then we bumped it about two and a half to three thousandths and you can see the groups opened up. Um, this one here, 0 0.202 and no wind, not bad. So, um, but this one in the wind, boy, that had some serious vertical. Um, so you can see here from this side here, I'd say two thousandths bump is probably a really good bump. Um, this is in a 6 PPC uh, cartridge. Um, if you do bump a little bit more, two to two and a half to three thousandths, um, well, not too bad, but um, you run the risk in windy conditions of possibly getting something like that. So I would recommend definitely stick within the two thousandths uh, bump range. Um, if you do bump a little bit more, um, what I would recommend is sorting that one out and using that as a fowler. Um, and again, you can check the bump um, with this type of case gauge micrometer really fast, really quick, easy reading, very reliable, um, and get a sense for where you've bumped uh, even prior to loading your round. So um, so that's it, about 2,000 bump is, is, is recommended. Um, thank you for watching and please subscribe, like, and share.